So this is about exploring space, and space is big. We can use kilometres to measure distances, and quite big distances, but for really big distances, we use light years. Light years are massive. It's the distance it takes light to travel in a year. So for those really big distances, we communicate using radio waves, but even that takes a long time for that radio wave to travel over a really big distance. So you need to know about manned and unmanned space travel. Manned space travel have astronauts on board. Now the advantage to that is you've got humans on board to make decisions. But the disadvantages are that you may need more resources like food, water, oxygen, and you also may to include some spacesuits. Um, unmanned space travel don't have any humans on board. Uh, the advantage to that is, is therefore it costs less and you can investigate lethal environments which would potentially kill humans because you're not going to put any lives at risk. However, unmanned space flights need to be incredibly reliable as there are no humans on board to fix any problems. Now, unmanned space probes can measure lots of different things. Temperature, gravity, radiation, magnetic fields, all that information can be sent back to Earth by radio wave. And some of them can also bring back to Earth rock samples as well for analysis.